Hi guys, I'm back on, I'm back on air. <laughs> so, you know, I'm having a hard time getting this out of my mouth, but I'm doing this. So, today on May, or June, <laughs> today on June 29th, I am launching an improvement project. Now, a lot of you might be wondering, and by a lot, I mean the sum that kid. I'm just kidding. <laughs> But I know some of you are wondering about why I decided to put this project out now, you know, within three years of the show. Why didn't I do this before? Why didn't I address this? So basically, I was really thinking about the future of the show, right? I was thinking, you know, what do I really want the show to live up to? You know, because I, ever since I started the podcast back in 2020, my goal has always been and forever will be helping artists get the reach they deserve. There are millions of artists that exist now in this industry, but they get constantly overlooked at, right? Because you guys know the affirmative action, you know, you know, overturn. um, And now, you know, things will change later on in the college application process. So that really upset me, you know, but I don't want to, you know, I don't want to be in this, situation where artists are are continuing to be overlooked at. I want to give the light to artists around the world. You know, I want people to know that they have a place in music. You know, they might not be signed to a fancy label. They might not have all the money, but I want them to know how valuable they are to, you know, this industry. Because even now in the billboard charts, the billboard charts need to change because there's because, you know, radios just aren't pushing songs like they are. And, you know, the charts, they, the songs don't change. So my whole point is my project is called Let's Make It Stronger. And what, what this means is that things need to change. And I want to make sure that I meet 100%. I know that in the past, um, I have not taken change as, as seriously, um, but I am listening. You know, I am taking note of changes that the show needs to make. And before, I didn't really care about it, you know, to be honest, because I never thought the show would be this big, but it is now. Now people watch Rap It Out more than ever, you know? If I could show you guys the views, if I could show you how many people are listening on average, on average, over 200 people are listening to Rap It Out. I know to some of you, it seems like very small, but to me, it's like, Holy shit, this is happening. <laughs> Excuse my language. Um, but anyway, this entire project is completely from me. This project I have thought about today and I wanted to put it out today too. Because I realized that I need to do better with taking criticism, with taking thoughts, with taking ideas. I want all of that now. You know, now I want all of that. You know what I mean? Because I want you guys to remember that this show will always need to improve. It's not a perfect show. I know that. I've lived in the show. I've listened to recordings. I know how crappy it can be sometimes. (laughs) But I also know how it feels like when people don't listen to you and things don't change. I mean, look at Black people and look how long it took for change to finally happen to black people and yet we're still improving 100 years later so my whole point is that i want whatever's going on whatever the heck's going on if i need to do better while recording if i need to put something on ig to make y'all follow him more if i need to do anything please i beg of you please tell me and I'm not saying this out of anyone. Nobody inspired me to do this project besides me. And by inspired, you know, like I did I'm doing this project because I care about Rapido. You know, this show has changed my life forever. Um this show has really taught me to be more confident, more loving, more understanding, and really most of all being more versatile, being, you know, more open to all music. You know what I'm saying? 
you know, because I never realized that every day there's an artist out there that they deserve to be celebrated. And unfortunately, because of situations, they aren't. I want to do that. I have done that for a lot of people. You guys, I've met hundreds of artists throughout the years, and I want to meet more. So in order for me to get better, I need you guys to tell me because I'm not a, like, I'm a very observant person, but I'm not that observant. If you, if y'all tell me, I will meet 100% of changes. So, if, for example, y'all tell me that I, you know, and this is a real example, um, you know, on Discord, young Nixie, uh, Nixie, I'm sorry, I haven't spoken your name in a while, but he literally told me this, and I quote, he said, only concern I could have is the rate of release, to be honest. Not so much that my interview was so long ago, and I'm not uploaded yet, but more so that by the time it does upload, my interview will have such outdated information. P, sure, my February or March release was the most recent thing at the moment of, re- at the moment of recording, and so much has happened since then. Like I said, since then that, like I said, the info and all that is just going to, it's just going to be super outdated, but that's really my only concern to be honest. Again, the focus isn't so much just my spotlight or some selfish shit, more so the information all actually present to you present in the, in, in that interview and all. So you see how that works? He wanted me to release episodes in in better time frame. And that's something that I am working on. And that I'm gonna 100 percent change. I'm gonna make sure that when you guys get your interviews, that you don't have to wait so long. I know people have had like to wait months and months for this interview to come out. I'm going to change that. So I'm gonna make sure that whenever I interview somebody, I need to make sure that it gets released in the same month or within three months. So I'm going to make sure that happens, believe me, or not. This is coming from my mouth and this is what I'm saying. So that's pretty much an example I wanted to share with you because this stuff like this is gonna happen. You know, I just published the post today so I know there'll be people who will tell me stuff that I need to change, you know? So I want you guys to definitely let me know how I can make the show better. Mics, production value, questions, anything you guys need to tell me, okay? And I'm going to 100% change it. 100%. Not I'll try or... You know, I'll do that later. No, fuck that. I'm going to do it now. You know, this show needs to change now. You know, this show needs to change. Now that it's bigger, you know, I need to do stuff that is very much so important. You know, these changes are important to me. You know, what you guys are telling me, these ideas you're letting me know about, that is important to me. So... Whatever's going on, whatever it is, tell me. DM me on Instagram. DM me on Discord. Email me. Let me know. Rap pad. Message me on Rap pad. Uh, Snap. Um, Twitter. Um, God, <laughs> I don't want to keep listening forever. But <laughs> y'all, I just want you guys to know how much you mean to me. And how much he changes mean to me. And let's and let me just say this. Please do not sugarcoat. Do not, please, for God's sake, for gosh sake, sorry. Please do not sugarcoat. You know, I you know, here is the here's the thing, right? Like, I can't even begin to talk about, you know, how many times you know, people just, they just made the advice, you know, or whatever I need to change. Just so nice. I can handle anything y'all give me, you know. 
if it's something that I need to even change about my mic, tell me. I can I can set things up. I can change the. So, I want to thank you guys so much for listening to this. It'll be on all platforms, this message, but I just want to let you guys know. And, of course, I'm still releasing episodes, so you guys don't have to worry about, you know, is this like a goodbye message? No. This, I'm going to be releasing stuff. You know, I'm still going to be doing that. So, I'm still doing that. I'm still, the show's still going to go on. But this way, as I'm making the show happen, change is happening. So let, let's make 2023 the year of Rapido, the year where I change things and, and you know, greatness happens and we make it even stronger. So until next time, thank you guys so much for listening to this message. I hope that this message has helped you and that, you know, you've seen, you know, what's going on. So, you know, again, tell me how I can make things better. All right. Promise me that. All right, I'll see you guys next time. Love y'all. Bye.